What's up everybody, I'm MPC Nate, and today I want to talk to you about a little MMO called Mad World Age of Darkness. Now, I've never heard of this game before, and I sort of just stumbled upon it while browsing Steam. So, I want to make a video about it, talk about it, try to spread awareness because I think it looks really good, and maybe you will too. Okay, so, what is Mad World Age of Darkness? Well, I'll tell you. It is a top-down action MMO, just like Lost Ark. So, if you played that game, then this combat should look at least a little familiar to you. However, the art style is dark fantasy, just like a game called Darkest Dungeon. So, now I just want to spend a few minutes going over the information that's available on Steam. Okay, so let's look at some of the details here. Um, dynamic combat and class switch. Okay, so the combat system allows movement while attacking, which makes the combat more visceral and active on the player's end. Target lock on feature makes taking action easier. Okay, so you move around, you lock on, easy, right? Uh, rigid class system done away with weapon switching. Okay, so I think I've seen this before. Where basically there are not classes, there's weapons, and then you can switch weapons whenever you want. You can try them out. The different weapons will affect what skills you have. Uh, maybe sort of like Guild Wars 2, except there's just no classes at all. It's only weapons and weapon skills, which I like. I have no complaints with that. Uh, I think it's pretty neat. Uh, strategic action, various skills open up with single weapon swap, right? So you can just try out whatever weapon you want, see what you like and uh, not be locked into a class. So potentially, you know, you create one character and uh, maybe you can have a few different weapons that you like to use in different situations instead of having to, you know, necessarily class swap. You just, okay, I'm going into this situation, switch my weapon, there you go, you're set. Uh, so yeah, I like that a lot. Um, act, boss raid, ancient boss. Okay, so for each act, uh, story-based ba quests revolve around the powerful boss monster. Raid system connected to the boss monster also takes place each act. Eliminate the boss with trusted comrades and acquire materials for some serious equipment. Okay, so the way that I understand this is uh, you do quests and then that leads up to maybe like a raid, party up, and go clear the raid, kill the boss. But maybe it's a world boss, not 100% sure. Uh, due to influence of solar eclipse that occurs sporadically, Ancient Boss descends to Mad World. So that's why I'm not 100% sure if it's, you know, like an instance raid or if it's a world boss. I'm not 100% sure there. But uh, one way or the other, you know, the gameplay basically revolves around do quests, kill big boss. Uh, which is fine. It's, you know, it's fun stuff. Tried and true, right? Um, ancient boss can only be defeated through tight coordination between many players, right? So you cannot solo them. Uh, the rewards quality is befitting a boss difficulty. So please eliminate ancient boss and save the world. Okay. Uh, skill mastery, potential mastery, potential system that allows your character to lead the path you want, right? So it's, it's a talent tree, right? Everyone knows what this is. Uh, just from the image they've given us so far, it looks fairly complicated. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, if you play MMOs, basically, you know what you're looking at in general, right? Uh, by visiting red pillars across the world, you face harsh trial experience with the character's inner mind. Once trials overcome, players earn red crystals, which are used to freely learn skills that you might want. Okay, so there's like a, you know, a sort of currency you earn, spend them on, you know, your skill points, basically. Um, unfolding narrative and the world filled with despair. After the downfall of mankind, humans cling to the hope in the demon-led world full of despair. Through quests that reveal a profound story, a player can experience a new world designed Mad World MMORPG. Okay, so it's just saying, you know, the story, the general aesthetic, right? Post-apocalyptic demon world. Very dark, depressing. Uh, but if you're into that sort of thing, it could be very fun. <laughs> which I like I am I don't know why I like stuff like that I like darkest dungeon and things like that uh unique art concept grim fairy tale right so this basically looks like it looks like someone played lost ark and then went wouldn't this be cool if uh the art was from darkest dungeon and that's basically what it looks like and I love it I can't wait to play it 
this game is being made by a company called Jandysoft. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. It is a South Korean company. Uh, I don't really know anything about them. Um, I am following them now on Twitter. Uh, and it looks like they're planning a final alpha test for this game uh, May 25th of this year. So just next week. Uh, and if you go onto the website and sign up for it, maybe you'll get in. I have no idea. I'm signed up. I'm hoping I get in. Uh, and on Steam, there's not a set release date. It just says fall of 2022. Now, if they can pull this off, I am going to be all in on this game probably for a while because it looks incredible. And of course, maybe it won't be, but one, just from what I've seen so far, I am 100% on board for giving it the old college try and really, you know, putting some effort into it and seeing what it is. Hopefully I can get into an alpha or maybe at least a beta. And I'm not sure yet what the NDA would be on that or when I can make content about it. But hopefully I can make something soon. And that's it. That's all I know as of right now about Mad World age of darkness i'm going to try to get into this game as much as i can I'm going to try to get into testing like i said i'll be looking for more info and if i can find any more info and make another video about this i will so if you want to keep up to date with this game or if you just like content like this in general please don't forget to like and subscribe maybe turn the alerts on so that you get notified when i make a new video just a thought but either way Thanks for watching. I'm NPC Nate. Thank you and good night.